This week's theme is Love is Powerful. engaged to be married to a man descended from David. His name was Joseph, and the virgin's name, Mary. Upon entering, Gabriel greeted her, Good morning. You are beautiful with God's beauty, beautiful inside and out. God be with you. She was thoroughly shaken wondering what was behind a greeting like this. But the angel assured her, Mary, you have nothing to fear. God has a surprise for you. You will become pregnant and give birth to a son, and you shall call his name Jesus. Throughout Advent, we hear about God's love and how it was shared with an impoverished couple, about how Mary was invited to carry a child on God's behalf, about how Joseph was even invited to raise a child on God's behalf. That must have been some serious love that this couple shared and that God had shared with them. I can't really imagine the power of this love. Mary and Joseph stressed beyond normal pregnancy stress, and why wouldn't they be? They've been told up front that this is God's child, and that's a tall order to live up to. And yet Jesus' birth was just like your birth and my birth. In fact, in many ways, it was like every other birth. Jesus' birth was chaos, filled with the excitement and the worries that come before something wonderful happens. I suspect that Jesus' young mother, Mary, yet she was probably screaming, maybe cursing. She was definitely pushing probably crying and bearing down as she was sore and she was afraid. And in that stall, it was far from silent. This love that's being born, born into messiness, born into poverty, born to a family who will soon become refugees, is also a love of great power. Maybe not the power that the world sees, but the power of love acted out in compassion. Love that seeks out justice for the poor. Love that seeks out justice for the oppressed and the marginalized. Love that's capable of working in, with, and through, and beyond all that there is bring something out of chaos. It's an empowered love who weeps with those who weep, who suffers with those who suffer. A love that dances and sings and laughs and rejoices whenever and wherever love emerges in the midst of our world. That is the power of our Advent Christmas love. God, we ask that your powerful love, Jesus, be born in our hearts again. May this love empower us to be with and walk alongside all people in need of compassion 
grace and healing and justice. Amen. May it be so.